we have been asked to compare two rational numbers, 6 by 7 and 16 by 19. Up until now, we have seen a very logical way of comparing two rational numbers. If the denominators are the same, the rational number with the greater numerator is greater. And if the denominators are different, we make them same and then compare the numerators. Look at this example. The denominators are different. And using a calculator, we see that 6 by 7 approximately equals 0 0.8571 and 16 by 19 approximately equals 0 0.8421. Pretty close, I would say. Here, let's look at a simpler way to compare two rational numbers. Say we have two rational numbers a by b and c by d. We assume that the denominators b and d are positive integers. To compare them, we just need to look at two products. First, the product of a and d and second, the product of b and c. Product of these two and these two. But what do we do with these products? How do these two products help us compare the two rational numbers? There are three simple things we need to understand here. If AD, which is the product of A and D, is equal to BC, the product of B and C, then A by B will also be equal to C by D. If the product of these two integers is equal to the product of these two integers, then the two rational numbers will be equal. But what if AD is less than BC? Simple, then A by B will also be less than C by D. And if AD is greater than BC, then A by B is greater than C by D. That's how simple comparison of rational numbers is. If the products are equal, the rational numbers are equal. If this product is lesser than this one, then the first rational number is smaller. And if this product is greater than this one, then the first rational number is larger. Let's look at an example we saw a while back. We had to compare 6 by 7 and 16 by 19. So to compare these two rational numbers, all we need to do is compare the product of this integer with this one with the product of this integer with this one. AD in this case will be 6 times 19 and BC will be 7 times 16. 6 times 19 is 114 and 7 times 16 is 112. As we can see that 114 is greater than 112, we can be sure that 6 by 7 is greater than 16 by 19. That's how simple comparison of rational numbers is. But remember, the denominators have to be positive. So what if we were asked a question like this? Compare minus 6 by 7 and 16 by minus 19. Here, the denominator of the second rational number is negative. Does that mean we cannot compare these two rational numbers using this technique? Of course we can. We just write the second rational number differently. It's the same as asking us to compare minus 6 by 7 and minus 16 by 19. These two rational numbers have the same value. So keep in mind, if the denominators are positive, we can use this technique to compare the two rational numbers. <laughs>